shoot with a lens or to shoot without a lens? You know, it's everybody asks that question. What's it like in the dark? Uh, what do you see? For me personally, I don't use a lens. And the reason why is because when you're out here shooting dark targets in a dark hole, uh, when you have magnification, such as two, three, four, anything powered, it makes that harder to uh, pick up any kind of detail on the target. So with no lens, I'm, I don't want to call it silhouetting the target, but what I see with my naked eye is exactly what I see when I'm shooting. So what I'm looking for on the target as I'm glassing with my binoculars to find my aiming reference, when I start to aim, that's exactly what I see, you know, with my naked eye. I have to blur my binoculars to find, a, you know, maybe a spot or something like that. But what helps me um, in, in those situations is that uh, the, the power sometimes creates movement. You see yourself moving. And that's another thing for me personally that I like with no lens. The, the shake is less so it's easier for me to fire my shot. So the longer targets is a little bit more difficult and challenging in the aspect of your pin covers up a lot more uh, of the target. So I use a 10 thousandths fiber, which is the smallest that you can use, so that helps. But at the same time, covering your target is something that I've learned for a long, t you know, a long time ago, that's how I need to shoot the shot. So I just cover it up, whatever I'm looking at. And you know, I get the question, so, uh, how do you find those 12s at that distance? Well, I, I don't see the actual 12, I just know where it's at. So I make sure the bottom of my fiber is in the tin ring. So if the bottom of my fiber is in the tin, then the rest of it is absolutely up in the tin and also in the 12. That, try, you know, that will help me stay out of eight shooting low if I'm shooting at the low 12 and vice versa if I'm shooting at the upper, I don't allow the pin to go above the top of the tin ring. So, um, it is a little bit bigger than a 12 would be at 50 yards, but you don't have to have every 12 at 50 yards anyway. You just need to make sure you don't shoot a 10 or you don't shoot an eight. So uh, that's it.